Let's look at some of the fun things you can do in Space Claim in the realm of surfacing. To start off, I'm going to draw a circle on the screen. This is going to be the starting point of a handle, some sort of a grip. Using the pull tool, that circle turns into a surface. I can extend that and I've got a cylinder on the screen. Now that's not exactly what I'm after, uh, but what I will do is extend this a little bit further up and in fact I'll delete I just hit delete on the keyboard or control delete to get rid of the middle face and I'm left with the two ends. Now it's the two ends that I want to blend back together but do some, something in the way of creating um, a particular surface between the two. Using the sketch grid, changing the sketch grid option, I could dictate where I want my uh, sketch plane to be 90 degrees from where it was on that surface. Now let's add some contour, uh, some guide curves, that are, namely that are going to help define what my handle looks like. I draw in a three-point circle on the left-hand side. I connect the two ends of the circles, and that's going to be where my palm goes. To get the finger grips, I might elect to use a spline, and just go back and forth. Now, I don't care about how many grips there actually are on this. It looks like a little bit of an alien grip right now with just three grips, but that's okay. I hit escape when I'm done with the spline, and it'll start making a new surface body, or a solid body that's with some uh, freeform surfaces. Pulling between two surfaces, it gives me a preview of the handle. If I hold down the Alt key and grab one of those guide curves, you can see how it influences uh, the entire shape. Now I need to add the other guide curve in. I can't just hold the Alt key and select it because that's going to take effect and not the other one. So I need to hold down Alt and Control at the same time, click the other curve, and you see I have a preview of the handle now. If I can hit Enter on the keyboard or the check mark on the right hand side to solidify that and I'm done. Hiding the guide curves on the left hand side, you get a nice preview of what the handle looks like. So a very fast way uh, to make this in space claim. If you wanted to modify it, keep in mind this isn't a feature based system, however, all I would have to do is select the main body, or the main surface, and delete it. And I'm right back where I started. Each of these curves, as well as the surface bodies, I could modify those any which way I want to. Move them apart, make them bigger, smaller, doesn't matter. You have that flexibility. Then when it comes time to recreating this, hold down the, the control key to get both surfaces. Then hold Alt and Alt Control to get the second guide curve and you're done. And that's it. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you found this information uh, beneficial in the way of how to create complex surfaces in Space Claim.